Oh, will Jenny join the one million crit club? The plan, the plan full stop, capital T, capital P, the plan to hit Hu Tao's highest crit. Hello Genshin nerds, my name is Jenny and today I'm going to be showing you how to hit 1 million damage with Hu Tao. If you have any questions throughout the video, comment them down below, I'm more than happy to help. This was last week, we hit 785,945 damage with our Hu Tao. You think that might be the highest that I can possibly hit? That's not true. I can hit higher because when her burst hit, she healed over 50%. So she lost out on the damage bonus because her HP was over 50%. But it's okay, we've learned from our mistakes, guys, and we will hit higher. We're going with the team Bennett, Kazuha, Ayaka, and Hu Tao. It's post-production Jenny again. I just want to let you know, if you don't have these characters, you don't have to worry. There are some really good alternate team comp options. An alternative to Kazuha can be Sucrose. She'll give the team an elemental mastery buff which is great when we're hitting these elemental reactions like vaporize or melt alternatively to ayaka we can also use rosaria rosaria's burst gives a crit rate boost to party members you can even use shenha her passive means that when you tap her elemental skill the team's skill and burst damage is increased by 15 percent Mona is also a good option, although in most cases Vaporize can deal less damage than Melt in nuke settings, with Mona's burst providing a damage boost to the team, she's a great choice. So here's our Bennett. There's two buffs that we're getting from Bennett that are important here, and it's his burst attack buff and the four piece noblesse oblige buff. In order to get his highest base attack to make sure that we're getting the highest possible buff from Bennett, we've leveled him up to 90, which will give him a highest attack possible just from levels. We've given him one of the two swords with the highest base attack, which is the Achilla Favonia with 674 attack. And we've leveled up his burst to, we've crowned it. And then for the artifacts, we might be missing one, but it doesn't matter because we have the four piece noblesse oblige bonus there's a reason that all of these are level zero we do not want him to have high hp i don't want him to heal hu tao we're going to use kazuha kazuha is on full piece viridescent we're also worrying about his passive upon triggering a swell reaction he will grant all party members 0.04 elemental damage bonus so it's really important that the only element that we swell at this point is pyro i forgot to mention this during the stream but kazuha is on a full elemental mastery build mine is on the iron sting but freedom sword is better if you have it an elemental mastery sans goblet and circlet with some high em rolls on the flower and the feather the more elemental mastery you have the higher damage our hu tower is going to hit we've got to keep in mind his passive talent gives an elemental damage boost base off of his elemental mastery 3k hp 1.5k attack she's got 270 em 32 crit rate 265 crit damage and 61.6 pyro damage bonus and the three foods that we're using is once upon a time in monstat the shrimp crackers and the pyro potion let me just recognize it so we're gonna bennett burst and that will activate his attack buff and the noblesse oblige attack buff and then we're gonna switch to kazuha and we're gonna swell and plunge so swirling activates his passive and the four piece vv set and plunging will reapply pyro to the enemy and then we're going to switch to ayaka do ayaka's burst triggering a melt reaction which will activate her four piece instructor set bonus we're going to switch to hu tao use her elemental skill once it's only got cryo applied to the enemy we're going to burst scaramouche boss has become my go-to damage showcase dummy why 70 and not 60 i worry about hp honestly i just want to make sure he has enough hp for us to show the damage no imagine i die nice Whoa. Bruh. bro bro we're going to be changing to our food at the last minute. So when he activates the final attack, I'm going to use his food then. Here's good because he's put cryo ones here for me, which will be great because I can pick up some more of these little energy things. We just want to get this done as quick as possible. It's even better when you've like already used your food. So like, let's say my first hit isn't a critical hit. I can use the food and then if I get him stunned as quickly as possible or apply these like little dendro fired shots quick enough, I won't have to worry about my food buff running out after one run. Wish me luck, we're going to see if we can join the 1 million damage club. It just depends if I crit and get this set up right or not. What did we hit there? Rip.
crip, bro. I never crit, bro. This is always the hardest part about doing this damage test is trying to crit. It's so hard. If I like keep switching characters too much, I think I'm going to be too slow. And her attack, her HP is a bit lower now, which is a bit relieving to see. Okay. And I don't have to worry about food this time. I can just focus on getting the setup done. Yeah, bro, what am I saying? Like, you can tell I'm, like, nervous because I keep, like, stuttering over my words. All right, let's do this, guys. Okay, his shield is down. His shield is down. Let's hope this is the critical hit. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, wait. I think we did it. I think we did it. I think I saw a one. I think I saw a one. <gasps> guys. Oh, my gosh, we did it. We did it, right? One, let's count, let's count the zeros after that. 1.183. Guys, we're in the 1 million club. We did it. 1,183,605 damage with Hu Tao Verse. Can I get an I was here? I'm going to edit this, guys. I'm yes, sir. I knew it, guys. The setup worked and it can work for you guys too. It can work for you guys too. Trust me. Adobe clipped it. Let's go. Let's watch the clip. I'm concentrating so hard. <laughs> hello if you made it to the end of the video i just want to say i really hope you enjoyed it if you enjoyed the video feel free to subscribe we also stream on twitch every tuesdays thursdays and saturdays if you have any questions or want me to actually explain something live feel free to join over bye